Hello, this is Junichi Hagino, or it is Jun, and this is Fry fifth uh, video about the IPv6 technology. And somehow, uh, English version of this video was not uh, uploaded successfully, so I'm redoing this thing. But it, uh, sorry that it took like one month, but you know, I have been very busy uh, preparing for Worldcon, uh, World Science Fiction Convention. And the, uh, the, it was held in Yokohama, first time in Asia. So I met a lot of, lot of uh, science fiction also, science fiction fans, and it was so fun. And the, uh, if you missed it, you will, you know, you will be jealous. Um, so uh, I met, so yeah, anyway. So today I will talk about the IPv6 transition stuff and the uh there are two thing two main topic about this transition and the uh, one is called their stack and the another is called tunneling and the their stack is the uh technology where uh we we will we will make a uh, transition to ipv6 uh very smooth and gradually uh, because IPv6 is so successful that the everybody is using it and so there cannot be a flag day. So we cannot really say that the okay everybody starting tomorrow we will be using IPv6. It has to be you know gradually deployed. So it's a tough it's tough. So uh, the the thing called the stack is basically being bilingual. So I can speak in English and the, I was born in Tokyo. I can speak Japanese. I can speak other languages, a little bit of Korean and Chinese, but that's not the point. And the, for example, I can say that the, I study internet stuff and the, I internet So this was Japanese, so I can do that. So uh, just like that, uh, all the operating system. Uh, equipped with the IPv4 uh, and the IPv6. So, like Linux, all the BSDs and the Windows Vista, Mac OS starting 10.2, uh, they do implement IPv4 and IPv6 both. So, it can use IPv4 when it connects to IPv4 machines, and it can use IPv6 when you connect to IPv6 machines. So and the uh, so then uh, we put some IPv6 machines and the, then gradually we start using IPv6 and the, we prefer IPv6 than IPv4. Then we can we start using IPv6 and then gradually a uh, portion of our communication will be over becoming getting with more IPv6. So. So then uh, someday maybe IPv somebody decide to stop maintaining IPv4 and then world will be you know uh, IPv6 uh, dominated and uh, dominated is not a word right uh, I am thinking of a good word but anyway yeah so uh, this is just that so okay and the uh, the decision of the IPv4 IPv6 is done automatically. For example, if you uh, try to look, uh, see, uh, not okay, uh, see the uh, YouTube, like you type in www.youtube.com, and the, then it will be, it will be, um, um, it will be converted into IPv4 address or IPv6 address, and this is called, done by a system called DNS. But yeah, so if www.youtube.com can be mapped into IPv6 address. Uh, your machine will be using IPv6, and then it fails. Uh, it will it will try to look for IPv4 address. Then it will use IPv4, and the otherwise uh, it cannot connect. But yeah. So uh, today everybody because YouTube is IPv4 only, uh, we are using IPv4. Yeah, but the it. Do try to connect to uh, look for the IPv6 address of YouTube and the uh, sorry, uh, but the uh, it is it is not successful. So 
Uh, if you are inside of YouTube or Google Corporation, uh, YouTube is uh, presented by Google, right? Uh, uh, please talk to me and the, then please enable IPv6 on YouTube. Then it will be fun. And okay. Uh, the other technology is the called uh, tunneling. Uh, suppose that the, you're in the uh, Technology division and the, in the your company there's the uh, like the uh, uh, like the uh, uh, CEO office okay CEO office and the CEO office and the uh, technology division uh, using IPv6 but uh, corporate network operation is only IPv4. So then, how can we connect to uh, connect between two divisions by IPv6? So uh, the technology called tunneling is using is and the, this technology in this technology we uh, your machine transmit IPv6 packet. Then uh, your divisions uh, router will encapsulate it into IPv4 packet. So inside the IPv4 packet there will be IPv6 packet. And this will be transmitted to CEO office, and the CEO office will be uh, decapsulating, so uh, getting the inside out in, of the packet. So then it will get IPv6 packet. So then that IPv6 packet will be uh, will reach your CEO's machine. So that is called tunneling. And the uh, even within a uh, between like in two universities or maybe ISP and university, we use tunneling uh, sometimes when we cannot deploy IPv6 native network, which is uh, basically uh, like which requires the upgrade of both to you know uh, directly connected routers. So sometimes it's not possible, and the, in that case we use tunneling. Then uh, how do I say? Yeah, uh, if you are using a technology like IPsec or VPN. Uh, actually, this is very similar. But anyway, it's you know geek stuff, right? So even if you have no idea what I'm talking about right now, uh, it is okay. Uh, you know, you can you know ask uh, other techno technical stuff to do something about it. And the if they have no idea or they are afraid or that the uh, your configuration may you know IPv4 configuration may be uh, affected, just talk to me. Then I will be able to help you or help your technical guys. And the you know I will I am posting video like this. And the actually so the goal is to you know have more fun with you using IPv6, right? So I think IPv6 will be able to provide you with more fun stuff. So that's why I'm trying to do this. And yeah, I have been doing this for 10 years, more than 10 years. So, you know, um, maybe I'm too persistent, but the, I'm trying this new stuff, YouTube. So anyway, yeah, this is my fifth video, fifth uh, English version video, and the, yeah. Okay, that's about it. Uh, okay, a little bit of fun stuff. Um, the, uh, in Worldcon 2007 in Yokohama, I have been implementing IPv6 in, at the venue. And the, at the venue, uh, well, of course, because I did this, I deployed IPv6 at the venue. And the, uh, we uh, had the public uh, uh, Macintosh, Machines, Mac OS 10 machines, uh, for the public use that the that the some of the science fiction authors are using at Macin those, those Macintoshes. So those those users are using IPv6 even without knowing it. So it was cool for me, and yeah, it's fun, right? And the uh, I have been doing uh, interpreter for famous authors like. Uh, David Ring and the Larry Neven and the, yeah, they remember me. So I'm, you know, as a fan, it's, you know, super, super happy, right? It's so great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's, a, you know, that time is running out, so I will terminate it. But, you know, I can talk about like 10 hours, right? Okay, bye.